Hey, Matt Man's back. Let's compare home style waffles, buttery round crackers, and canned chicken. So I'm going to change the format up a little bit. I'm going to move the nutritional information recordings to the end of the video. I've been losing viewers there and um, I think it's important to include them in any kind of real comparison but if you really want to see it you can go to the end of the video. Let's compare canned chicken breast. We have here is the Aldi Brookdale brand. We have the Swanson name brand and we have the Tyson name brand and of course the great value from Walmart. Now I put two name brands in there because they've been doing so pathetically in these comparisons I thought I'd give them a better chance. <clears throat> Alright, some quick packaging information here. The Brookdale, it does not have a pull tab. The others do. And um, this is a different style lid than these two. These two look identical. Um, the printing those two printings are identical just different format could have came off the same line on these two the printing is identical could have came off the same line what's interesting are there's a little dent there and there's a bigger dent there that looks like it was made when it was packaged. Interesting. Okay, I'm going to have my assistant put a sample in each of these bowls here and we'll taste them and see if there's any differences between them. Back with you later. So we tested all the product here. Um, I can tell you right off that there isn't a whole lot of difference between them, but there is some difference. The ones on the top have a little more mealy texture. Um, it seems like there's a little more fat in it. It just just seems that way in the tongue, but not objectionable. Very good. I like these a little better. Um, again, um, a little more solid, a little uh, better texture, but you know the flavor's all fine. So. I'm going to give all these a draw, and the cheapest one wins. What did you think? I thought the green one was slightly drier. Drier. You know, I thought that too. Okay, so, um, yeah, we'll call the yellow one for me the best, but very marginally. Do you have a favorite? Nope. All right, let's check them out then. In the blue bowl is Swanson. Huh. In the dark blue ball. Tyson. Both brand names were lower. We I like the Aldi the best. Again, marginally. And that leaves the Walmart at three cents more a can. We're going to call Aldi the winner, but either one of those is fine. Stay away from the name brands again. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to mix all this up into a chicken salad. And we're going to test some buttery round crackers. Let's compare round buttery crackers. We have the Savor It's brand from Aldi, the name brand Ritz, which I have always been very brand loyal to, and the great value 
buttery rounds. I'm going to have my assistant lay out a bunch of crackers on these plates here and we will enjoy them with the chicken salad I made from all the cans of chicken in the last comparison. When we're done with the comparison we'll come back and let you know. All right back from our little lunch. Um, <clears throat> these crackers are pretty much well they're they're the same but there are differences. I believe those are the Ritz. Those are my second favorite. Those are my third. Um, if those are the Ritz, I think that I'd pay the extra money instead of getting those. What do you think? I thought the one in the middle tasted slightly better. You like the one in the middle. Okay, we have a difference. All right, well, let's see. I am wrong. Okay. And the Ritz were number two. Bye bye Ritz. And the, all these three. So I think I prefer, well the Walmart crackers are cheaper. Walmart wins this round. Sorry Ritz. Another brand name bites the dust. Let's compare toaster waffles. We have all these breakfast best home style waffles. We have Kellogg's Eggo home style waffles. And we have Great Value home style waffles. Now, there's 10 in that box, 10 in that box, only 8 in that box. 9.8 ounces, 12.3 and 12.3. Boxes look different enough in packaging to preclude any uh, coming off the same line. I will have my assistant toast up a bunch of these. We'll taste them and we'll let you know what we think about them. All right, back with the verdict. I like the one on the white plate the least. I like the one on the yellow plate in the middle and I like the ones on the orange plate the best. These just didn't toast upright. You know, these got a little golden brown, those did. So that's a knock on them. What do you think? No difference in taste. Okay. So it's kind of a price thing then. Well, we'll see about these. So. Ego is the worst. My God. Walmart second. And Aldi is third. Alrighty then. Aldi wins on taste and price. Alright, back with a recap. Before I wrap this up, I want to encourage everybody to subscribe if you're getting any kind of value out of this at all. Please share it, hit that notification bell, do all the things that will help me provide value to you. In this video seven, I compared three different product lines, canned chicken breast and Aldi one, both on taste and price, the buttery round crackers, Walmart one, basically based on price, and, and the frozen waffles, Aldi wins, based on price, again, all three brand names, really four brand names, were not even comparable. Okay, so I've now done 80 products over 30 product lines. So the new score is Aldi has 15 wins, the name brands just one, and Walmart gained one to get to 10. 
I will show the nutritional information next, and that'll wrap it up. Thanks for watching. The nutritional facts on the great value canned chicken. The nutritional facts on the Swanson canned chicken. The nutritional facts on the Tyson canned chicken. The nutritional facts on Aldi's Brookdale canned chicken. This is the nutritional information on the Aldi Savor It's round butter crackers. This is the nutritional information on the Ritz crackers. This is nutritional information on all these great value brands. This is the nutritional information on all these breakfast best brand home style waffles. This is nutritional information on the Eggo home style waffles. This is the nutritional information on the Great Value Homestyle Waffles.